Hello folks and welcome to today's show. My name is Chris Knox. I'm your host. Today's where we have a very special word requested from one Jason H. of Los Angeles. And the word today is Incarnudine. <laughs> Incarnudine is a great word. It has two basic forms. It has an, uh, an adjective form. Two. An adjective form and a transitive verb form. And we all know how much I love transitive verbs. Now the first one of the uh, adjective form is to having a fleshy pink color. <laughs> fleshy pink color. Now, uh, what do you know mm, that has a fleshy pink color? Mm. Uh, moving on. Now, the second definition is to have a red or a blood red color. Now, the other one that's really fun is uh, it's a transitive verb. Again, you know how much I love transitive verbs. And that is to make red or crimson. So, we're going to use this word in, in a sentence. The first sentence comes from one's Kevin Keaton. We like Kev. Uh, Kev was right. It's been called uh, Kilroy was here. International Travel News, October 1st, 2001. Now, Kevin wrote, uh, Captain Dobo opened the castle's wine cellars and broke open the casks of, for his men who greeted the Sultan's soldiers without first politely wiping the incaridine wine from their blood red lips and their bearded chins. Anyways, hope you enjoyed. You know, as always, try using it in a sentence. Uh, but uh, you have a good day, and we will see you later on this word of the day. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Oh, check this out. Before you go, I'm going to make the entire uh, spot incaridine. Check this out. One, two, three! <laughs> Ah, that's cool. All right. Bye for now. Bye.